What's up guys? Welcome to Draw School. Today we are doing a drawing session. Now listen, if you guys haven't subscribed, go ahead and do that now. Like and comment. I will be giving away an little sketchbook on the next episode or drawing session. You never know what it is. But like I said, today I'm going to pick randomly some words and then from the words I'm going to draw something. Alright? Run my intro. So first thing I'm gonna do is let's go get some inspiration. Maybe we find like a a word maker. What are, what are those called? Word a word generator. Word generator. We'll find a word generator and we'll make some random words. Let's pick three words. How about that? Three words. Let's go with snobbish. Strong. Snobbish strong queen. Snobbish strong queen. Now that's going here. Let's find our queen. That's kind of cool. <laughs> I like that. Let's do that one. Boom. Strong woman. Is that Zoe's Alabama? Okay guys, we got our reference. Now we start sketching. Now I don't want to spend too much time on this. So I think I'm going to do 10 minutes for the sketching part. And then 20 minutes for the finish. So I think I got her pose there. I think I'm happy with that. So if you guys have questions on how I came up with this pose and why I made them, made everything the proportions they are, please go back and watch my other videos where I explain things like arms, legs, torso, and things like that, and you will get an idea. I am going to move on to sketching the face now. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to sketch the face now. again guys this channel is just teaching you how to use reference to create your own characters that's what we're doing that's the goal here let's draw some cheeks there okay now hair I still like the Queen's hair up here so let's add that 
I'll add the part here. Sorry, I didn't talk much while I was doing the face expression because I was over here making all the face expressions. So it's hard to talk when you're making that face, you know? so you guys know how long stuff actually takes around here in these streets when you're trying to draw stuff don't think everything is rushed and don't think people are just super fast they're just actually taking the time to make things look good how they want it so you have the ability to be great just take the time to be great Take the time to be great. This is about to be a modern style. I'm not about to go straight off the reference now because she's a modern queen. I'm gonna have to get a reference for a, whatchamacallit, two. Man, I don't talk. A reference for her crown is what I'm gonna have to find, guys. Not a whatchamacallit. I gotta remember you guys are learning, so I gotta talk. <laughs> Can't just internalize everything. All right, so that's a sketch. Cool, let's go ahead and refine now. even the picture finding process with you guys I thought that's that's helpful so you guys can know how to look for reference because a lot of times I have no idea what I'm gonna draw or if you wait to draw when you have an idea of what to draw sometimes you're just not drawing enough because you're like oh I'm not inspired to draw right now because I don't know what to draw Sometimes it's good to just have to force yourself and find something that you want to draw. Or not even that you want to draw, just force yourself to draw something. Like me, I'm drawing a queen, snobbish queen right now. Just cause that word generator told me to. I am overlaying my sketch and sort of making better the decisions I have already made in my sketch. I'm just making sure that I am making it more clean. Perfecting is the wrong word because it's not gonna be perfect ever. You're always gonna wanna keep going and making things better, but at some point you have to decide that it's finished. That's why drawing a lot is important.
if you guys go back to my how to draw hands video, you'll see the formula that I've come up with to draw hands without having to look at reference. Because you're probably like, wow, how is he drawing that hand? He's not looking at reference. I have my ways. It took me 25 minutes to do that video, I believe, or longer. So I just suggest you go back and watch it. Nine minutes, nine minutes left, guys. Maybe you guys can write in the comments, will you wear, would you wear that outfit? Oh snap, we are out of time. Wow, 30 minutes goes by fast. You know, actually I'm gonna go in here and do a little bit of shading, I'm gonna cheat a little bit, spend a little bit of time shading, but as far as sketching goes, I'm done. This is our, our queen, strong queen, what were the words? Hold up. Snobbish strong queen snobbish is her face pretty much. I'm gonna go in here and do a little bit of shading um, Not the happiest with it Could have done better should have warmed up You guys should warm up. We all should warm up before we start doing things like this, but like I said I am going to shade a little bit here for a few more minutes past 30 minutes and we'll see what happens So this is what we came up with. Uh, the words were queen, snobbish, strong. That's a 30 minute drawing with a little bit of shading just so I could feel better about myself. And that's what we came up with, guys. Well guys, that was it. I can't say I was too happy with that one. I mean, 
we had 30 minutes. 30 minutes is not that much time. If you wanna create some awesome drawings, you really have to take your time to make them awesome. Like how awesome were those, was that reference I pulled, right? It was crazy. But anyways, hopefully you guys like that. Make sure you subscribe, like, and comment for a chance to win an ILO sketchbook, which I am giving away on the next episode. Hopefully you guys like that. Let me know in the comments what you want me to draw next or what you want to learn next. Thank you and I'll see you guys on the next one.